Hello, friends. Uh, we are back again today with a quarantine haul. So, I guess like one of my, I guess hobbies <laughs> is um, retail shopping. And now that we can go to the mall and peruse things <laughs> before buying it, we're just now buying stuff online and. Uh, yeah, we gotta keep the economy going. We got like some things that we actually need and uh, Some things that um, you know since we're not going to the gym I needed to get some things so that I can exercise effectively here at home. So yeah, this is going to be a collective haul um, From all of these six weeks So yeah, let's start first one is the ones that I got like really early on which are these these are resistance bands uh, I have a lightweight one a medium and a heavy um, I had thought of like getting like actual weights but first and foremost everything was already like sold out or whatever you can find online was like priced too too much and i'm also thinking like oh when the gyms reopen where am i gonna put all of these stuff so for now resistance bands these have been like saving my life i already have like two um bands for the legs so i didn't have to buy those ones uh yeah but this one i got from amazon for i think 25 dollars for all of all three of it and it came in separate bags which is really great for when you want to keep them all all nice and neat yeah resistance bands next one is this is heavy or not really heavy but like um big This is my 10 pound slam ball and yeah, she is really nice for um, like just very versatile too. Like you can do squats with it, you can do a lot of core exercises with it, you can use it as like a BOSU ball. Um, yeah, really nice. So slam ball or wall ball, I got this from uh, Dick's. I think I forgot how much this was, but um, I had like a 25% a of coupon, so I used that one for this. Uh, next two are also still kind of workout related. So this one is um, a bra from uh, She Fit. It's, I think it's really heavily advertised on Facebook. Like, it won't like pass like 30 seconds before, like of scrolling before I see an ad for it. And it's actually pretty good. It comes in like a, a bra bag that you can put it on when you put it on the, the washing machine. And this is what she looks like. I haven't used this one yet, but I got the medium support and uh, they're all like customized um, well not customized but you put your measurements on like your um, rib and chest circumference and then they tell you like which size you're gonna go for so I got the size Lux and I got this one a black one and look at these it's like rose gold um, print on it which is really neat the thing that got me to buy it is that it has velcro straps velcro straps like in the back and you can adjust it to the tightness that you want for your rib cage and also it has velcro straps on the front where you can adjust like your um, shoulder straps. So that's really good. I've used the other one that I got. It's uh, like a coral peach color. And uh, um, I would give this like a uh, three and a half star rating, I would say. Um, 
the fabric is really really good and I like that it's also a front closure um, bra because I don't know how other people can get like sweaty sports bra off after without like struggling more so I always like I always prefer like the front close ones and this one also has I like, uh, you can see kind of want focus that there's a there's hooks here there's so that when you're putting it on it's easier to zip up um, and yeah another con like the the con that I was telling you about before I got distracted was that since the X on the back um, moves it kind of rides up your shoulders over here when you raise your arms so that's the only con but for the most part fabric is really really good it's thick but not too thick that you know it's super super duper constricting i still kind of want it to be a little bit more breathable which it is and um all the hardware is very sturdy in my opinion and yeah um, I'm still gonna use it but I think I am going to use it more for during my uh, my leg day workouts because this one won't work if I'm moving my arms too much yeah but yeah, it's really really nice I think they're only available online next is also still workout really <laughs> this is from the company called NVGTN navigation and these are their leggings and i already used two of the other ones that i got like a magenta color and um like a, an aqua blue color and i also got like a gray and i would give it a four star i would still prefer the the victoria's secret sport um incredible leggings and because those ones kind of stay put this one's the elastic on the top kind of rolls i don't know if it's just my fats <laughs> that's making it roll down but that's what it does for me but the length is good it's not too long usually when i do buy um like regular length leggings they're so long because i'm short so i have to go for the seven eights but this one is like a a uh, regular fit and it just stops a little bit above my ankle so i really really like it the the fabric is actually really soft but it is squat proof and uh, it also doesn't show uh, wet stains so i like this one it has like these contours like on the butt part so that when you look at it, it makes your butt look uh they make your butt look bigger yeah so yeah there you go nvgtn i got three leggings next one uh skincare I got some new, well, not new, but I got uh, a, another set of skincare because the ones I, I was using was already all used up. Like all the, all my jars were all scraped, empty, and I just needed new ones. And also my skin has been uh, not the best. I'm having a break up there. It's still peeking through some of the makeup uh, and some over here are like concealed, so and i have to get ones that i already know works for me because i don't want to waste money on trying new things right now that i know doesn't work or i don't know yet if they do but you know skincare is very expensive and right now i'd like to like not be spending on things that i'm not sure if it works for me or not so first and foremost i got this one this is the uh, dr dennis gross alpha beta peel and this one i already um i already used about like 
two packs of this one before so I already know uh, that it works well for me. My skin can handle a lot of acids and I think like it likes to be like exfoliated a lot so the, this one really really works for me um, and it comes in this pack so you use the, the number one put it on I uh, leave it for two minutes and then you do the number two and it comes in like all separate um, packages like that so one a day very sanitary and I, this one is the I think the regular formula and I did get like a small pack of the extra strength one just to see how it goes if it helps with my um, scarring uh, faster I already used one of this one yesterday and whew, it's intense yeah if you're not used to like chemical peels do try to use it with caution and uh, use it like once every one to two days first see how your skin reacts and of course always use sunscreen uh, next one um, uh, what you call it moisturizer I got the fresh vitamin nectar moisture glow face cream so this one also has um, some HA I think what does it say proprietary complex of vitamin C, E, and B5, lemon and orange fruit extracts. Um, I don't know if it does have some uh, some sort of acid here too, but I do feel uh, like kind of like when you, if you squeeze a lemon on your face, that that's what it feels like. But it is very glowy and I've already started using it it's over there in my bathroom already. Next one is a face cleanser. So I got the Origin Checks and Balance Foaming Cleanser. And this one is really, really good. Um, it lathers really well. Um, removes all excess oils without stripping your face. So I really like this one. And then I also got a mask. Also from Origin. And it is their uh, Origins Drink Up Intensive Overnight Hydrating Mask with Avocado and Glacier Water. So this one I put on at night and it makes my skin plump. I don't know if this is true or not, but I think this is what's kind of like helping me like kind of regenerate my uh, skin faster because if you think about it um if you moisturize at night then your face kind of is plump when you when you wake up in the morning and then uh when you wash it it's easier to remove all the dead skin um in the morning so i don't know this and then plus the peels it works I think well in for me it does so let me know if you try it <laughs> next ones are going to be Nick stuff and his is more exciting I think yeah so first is we have a easy 350v2 boost this is the cinder color uh, yeah, this one is not the black. It's like kind of like a charcoal gray color, and he really liked the black, but it kind of, it was always sold out, like just the black ones. And uh, I don't know, it's just too flat. So uh, he said he was gonna get this one, and he was able to grab it. So the only thing that's changed here is the laces. So this one's came with the the laces that are also like charcoal gray color but he changed the laces to the ones from the uh 350 v2 see a heel and these are the reflective ones so these kind of like a kind of customized it right he wants it to look like and then last one 
this is the one that just came out last or we just received last week and it is the Jordan 6 DMP and they look like this so it's really nice black and gold uh, trim it's also gold Jordan logo over there and that little um, like a strap thingamajig I forget what it's called um, but yeah apparently this shoe is has been postponed like the release one because uh, there's that the all-star weekend and then they didn't release it and then fit uh, they're going to release it like late February early March and then coronavirus happened so April they decided yeah they're gonna release it anyway because all the Yeezys that were coming out like people think like oh people are gonna not going to buy shoes because uh, coronavirus or whatever but Adidas and like all the other um, like shoe releases all sold out too so they decided to release this one and guess what yeah they sold out too so people are still buying things um, even though they are in quarantine so yeah so those are our those are the stuff we got uh, in the last six weeks I hope you enjoy so yeah it kind of like gives me some sense of normalcy and uh, I hope you enjoyed seeing what I hauled and yeah let me know in the comments below if you want to see more hauls in the future and what you want to see um, I'll see you in the next video bye